Grace, I'm back, and I apologize. I've been gone for really long, and this is what the story pretty much explains, and then explains why I won't be having thumbnails for a while, like the ones with the you know the emojis and the really cute border. Yeah, that's not gonna be happening for a while. Okay, so I guess let's get into the story. Okay, so. Sorry, my hair is like a mess. Um, the story starts out uh, around the week of May 1st. And, yeah, that week I was filming. And then that Friday was the night of our school dance. And I just, I don't know if it was just, I don't know. That was something I ate or just being around, like, all those people, you know. Because it was a ton of, like, people at this dance and and so at this dance I guess I just I caught something I got sick and the next day I wasn't feeling too good and my voice just my throat was hurting and my, my voice wasn't very good at all I literally sounded like a fog <laughs> and it lasted, and usually when that happens, it lasts of like four days, three days, it just depends. And this lasted until the middle of the week, this week. And, oh gosh, I wanna say Wednesday, Wednesday is when my voice like, it was back, it was here. <laughs> And I was happy that it was here and it was back. I was good. And then I was going to film, like, I was going to film Friday. I was. I'm just, I was going to film. But something happened, just had to happen on Thursday. And that was, I was, I do this thing at my school called award show. I did this last year and I'm doing it this year. And I'm planning on doing it when I go to high school. And so at this award show, I was practicing and getting all that. My phone was in my bag. Well, just so it happened, that when I, I literally, okay, thinking my phone was going to be in my bag, I walked out to the, um, like, I guess it's like the front of the school. I mean, I get confused. When I first came to my middle school, I was confused, okay, because it was like the back and then the front, well, the front of the school. And so I walked out to the front of the school because I was like, okay, my parents are going to be picking me up. From here I take out my I don't take it out I <laughs> unzip my backpack in the part where I always put my phone and just with my luck it was gone it wasn't there and I went back inside and I went to the teachers that like run the whole thing and I'm like did somebody pick up a pink phone that has one direction as lock screen Nobody. We looked on the cart. We even called my phone with one of the teacher's phones. And we even searched through my whole backpack. And I was so mad because I'm just like, why would somebody want to steal my phone? Like, I was not believing that. I was, at this point, I was like, nope, not believing it. Don't even want to go there. I don't even want to go to that conclusion that somebody stole it. So I even went back to my locker to see if I, like, just left it in there. You know, I was for sure I didn't because I put it away back, like, before when she said that we were going to start, like, our opening dance because we had to do those in our closure, which would be that Friday, which would be, like, two days ago. And so we did that. And... I mean, we searched for, honestly, I want to say like an hour. 
after practice ended. We never found my phone and so I had to go, like they had to open the office door because like after hours it's obviously locked. And so one of the teachers, like every teacher I guess has a key or something. And so they had to unlock it and I had to call my parents from the office phone. I called my mom and I told her what happened. And so she comes here and we still kind of are looking for it a little bit. We call it more and nothing. So now I just was hoping that like the janitor or somebody picked it up. Like I left it somewhere and they just were cleaning it and picked it up. I was hoping. Well, the next day I like come to school and everything. I, I come to school and I check the office. I check my friend's backpacks that were around me because I was like, oh God, because I was kind of in a rush. Like maybe I put in one of their backpacks. Well, that did not happen. I did not put it in one of their backpacks. I checked them, not there. And honestly, if to be honest, I think that if this was an accident, that every time they called my phone on Thursday, it would have, like, they would have answered it, you know? I mean, any normal person would if they weren't trying to, like, keep it and steal it. They didn't have it for themselves. Well, on Thursday, this is all what happened on Thursday. On Thursday, we everything's like you know it's awful and my phone's gone and all that and so we're like using find my iPhone we never find my phone it's like offline or whatever and so my dad has to put like this lock thing on the phone that keeps it that keeps people from like getting into it even though I have a passcode but like you know people can hack that stuff so he like that lock keeps them from getting beyond that passcode and once they do if they do have that passcode it will like ring to a parent's phone which will tell us exactly where it is on friday as i know i started explaining as i came to school it wasn't there i checked my friends backpacks and all that i know i'm like jumping around here i'm sorry it's just kind of like i'm trying to tell the story and it's just i don't know i'm going everywhere i'm sorry but um as I was saying, I'm just like, okay, I don't know what I'm gonna do. This is not normal, like, at all. And I went to our officer at school, told her what happened, she was like, yeah, somebody definitely stole it. We even checked like the security cameras to see if we could see anything, because yes, we do have those in our school, in certain hallways and everything, not there. No, we didn't see anybody with it, and, you know, at this conclusion, I want to say it was, like, one of the tech crew people, but you never know. It could have been, it's obviously somebody from the cast. I did not misplace my phone. Like, the teachers were like, oh, you probably just misplaced it. Um, no, that's not what happened. My phone doesn't just spring links and walk out the door. It really doesn't. And so, after we we're done with that whole situation on Friday. When I got home, I still did not have my phone, which I use for thumbnails, by the way. And I just put it on my computer and then I put it to that. I should probably start just doing these in the head if this ever happens to me again. Well, um, this conclusion that when I got home on Friday, that we had that I was just going to have to, um, use my brother's phone for the weekend because we were going to my cousin's graduation and use that for music and also we were at the conclusion <laughs> that um well my phone's been stolen and apple hopefully i hope they do they might replace it we're not for sure on that yet there'll be more updates soon to come to that but Right now, I don't have my phone. We filed a police report at the station on Friday. 
and the guy was really nice and we got that all taken care of and the reason why you file a police report for like something that's been stolen like a bug because one it's a personal item so times a lot of times phones have really like personal things in it that they really wouldn't share with anybody else but maybe their like closest friends or family and yeah and also they had links to all my social media which would be musically snapchat and instagram and that's not good so also we also filed a police report because if when we find out who took it we can press the charges and get all that taken care of and i just hope that that person i mean maybe gives it back or i just you know get a new phone obviously this is what I'm, I, right now like i'm getting a new phone it's not gonna happen i'm not gonna get my actual phone back um this is the end of the story i hope you guys enjoyed it this is not a made-up story this is real this actually happened and that's why i've not been filming videos for a while i wait for like a lot like a long time <laughs> not a while but a long time and i'm sorry that i'm again not been on the channel and everything and i will try my best on the instagram account like i keep saying that i will like keep posting i'm sorry i'm usually up to date with that i try i've been trying so hard to get time to actually get on the fan account and upload stuff upload updates and i apologize for that so i guess they're free in the future if you're watching this i hope you just understand i've been very busy lately and i just haven't had time like it doesn't really cross my mind every day to just oh i need to upload a you know i need to upload something on the instagram account and especially since i don't really have my phone i can't really I mean, I can't do that, obviously. So, I will see you guys around. And please like and subscribe. And I will see you guys later. Bye!